Okay, let's talk about cutoff blocks. Here's the last one, one-on-ones. So I'm a backside guard. I got a two-eye. I'm a backside tackle. I got a four-eye. And I got to cut a defender off. Just remember this when you're teaching a guy to cut somebody off. There's two things that really matter. Your target, meaning where you put your face mask, and your backside hand. So I have to get my, my nose to the inside number, and I got to get my backside hand inside the framework of his body. If I do those two things, I can cut this guy off. Go put your hat on the inside number and fit your backside arm inside the framework of his body. If you do that, you will cut him off. If you miss on either of those, it gets really hard. And, and really, you won't be able to cut guys off. Because this is a cutoff block where the ball could be running off of my block. So I cannot allow any penetration here as a backside guard on this two eye. I got to go inside number target and spear his inside number with my face mask and get my backside hand inside the framework of his body. Okay, let me show you a couple here. All right, so here's Jed from two years ago. Inside target. I got to cut this guy off. I'm running inside zone to the left. I got to cut this guy off. I got to get my hat inside. Get it inside. Get your hat inside. Now, the defender turns sideways on him, so I'm okay with his right hand, but he wins that cutoff block. Here's another one. Let's watch the right tackle. I have got to cut this guy off. I got to get my hat, my face mask on his inside number. I got to get my backside hand inside the framework of his body. A little short with the helmet, right? A little short on his target. 